Rockstar just quietly announced that the next big Red Dead Online update for console and PC is coming this December. We got all the details right here, right now. Howdy Cowpoke, Austin BMXer, and thanks for checking out today's video. We got some super exciting news. Uh, not too much crazy news, but it is super exciting. As you just see, as mentioned before the update, Rockstar just quietly announced that the next major update is coming in December. They didn't give us any more coming soon. There was a news wire that dropped today outlining some uh, fix, not too many fixes, but more of benefits for PC players that are coming to the game. Uh, we'll go over that here as well in this video later on. But way down in the bottom of the news wire where we usually see, stay tuned for more information on the next big update, Rockstar actually shows this right here. It says, and when the next major update to Reddit Online comes to PC, PS4, and Xbox this December, PC players will also receive a variant of the brand new Marino Bandolier, plus a new off-hand holster and additional care packages as a gift. So they did just give PC players a big care package, kind of like the stuff we got on console over drip feed before the summer update. And so down here in the bottom of this news wire, they actually state that the next major update to Red Dead Online comes to PC, PS4, and Xbox. Not sure why it doesn't say Stadia or Steam, because that launches here in a week or so. Coming this December. December. Me next major update. And it also states that the PC players will receive a variant of the brand new Merino Bandolier. So PC players are going to get one of these free, but that means there's bandoliers coming to the game as well in the next update. That's about all the information we got right now. That's some pretty awesome stuff. Smash that like button right now if you guys are super excited for the next major update coming in December, in the next few weeks. And we get bandoliers as well. We've been wanting those for a while. Definitely after the Frontier update came when we got those with uh, some of the bounty outfits. We weren't able to accessorize with them, but it looks like they are definitely coming. That's about all the information we got for the update right now. We'll get the discussion going right now, so if you want to jump off, go ahead, but stick around, hit some comments up, let us know how you feel, and we'll get right into the rest of the newswire. So first off, I wanted to get out that information as soon as possible, because that is the meat, the minty big game meat of this video, letting you all know that there is a major update coming, and it's coming pretty soon. So the newswire that dropped didn't actually drop on the main newswire page. It's kind of hidden a little bit. I did see a little tweet from them and clicked on this link and was super excited when I got to the bottom. But the newswire does state that uh, they, they fixed a whole bunch of the PC stuff in there. They're sorry for PC players dealing with all these issues, mainly with uh, Red Dead Redemption, the game itself crashing. So that's definitely a bummer so because we want those guys to be able to play that game in the story mode and learn all that stuff. Um, but the PC players are receiving a major... Uh, care package to as a gift and yeah console players we have some issues as well in the game we've received quite a lot of free stuff over the months so uh, PC players I definitely feel for them right now and I'm glad they're getting something major here it does say all PC players have received the, the finely detailed Pedro Poncho uh, available for free at your wardrobe so make sure you guys are watching for that and also I have it linked up here on the screen major huge care package they're getting a hundred times of all express ammo revolver pistol repeater rifle 100 shotgun slugs 20 incendiary buckshots 20 fire arrows 20 poison throwing knives 20 volatile fire bottles 10 potent miracle tonics three horse revivers 10 minty game meat and 20 baked beans so huge care package for them that's pretty awesome uh, console players don't worry uh, we've got a lot of stuff they have in right i mean just the the club rewards that you got, even if you didn't get the outlaw pass, was quite a lot of stuff. And remember, PC players didn't get that at all. So um, I do feel for the PC players that are having major issues, even just launching the game. So this is a little way to, to give that incentive back to them as the issues get fixed. I, I know on console and across all platforms online, there's some major issues right now. Maybe this update, the next big update to fix it. Maybe Rockstar has been wanting to fix those updates, but maybe there's something huge they didn't want to drop you know, a 10, 15 gig update in the middle of this Frontier Pursuit stuff. So we'll have to wait and see for that. But moving on to more stuff we've received over the last few weeks. So we do know that there is an Outlaw Pass coming. Uh, we did have a video up on it recently. They did change some of their wording on 
their uh, wiki page for Red Dead Online that states there's a new membership period starting soon. And then at the very bottom, it did uh, mention that the current rewards that we just got were part of season one. So we knew there was a season two coming and uh, to stay tuned for more information. Um, so now we got the information that the next major update is coming in December. So when in December do you think you guys will see it? Uh, my personal opinion, uh, they also did announce the day, or they didn't announce today, but they reminded us all today that the Red Dead Redemption 2 is coming to Steam on December 5th. Now that isn't on a Tuesday, as I think it's a Thursday. So we may not see anything until right after that, um, which would be, uh, so that'll be December 10th as the, the first Tuesday after Steam launches. So we may see this update then. Um, that would be a good time to start it a couple weeks before Christmas break. I definitely don't think they'll launch it the week of Christmas. And then of course the 31st is the last Tuesday of the month. Knowing Rockstar, they could. They could say wait for it in December and drop it on the very last day because we know how the summer update went, right? At least they're not calling it the winter update and uh, then we never know when it does. At least they told us it's coming in December. Hopefully we get some more information and bigger details on it on Friday. If we do, make sure to stay tuned to the channel because we'll definitely let you know exactly what's going on there. And if we get some information on Friday, we'll get a video drop for that as soon as possible. Um, I would suspect either the 10th or the 17th will be the days we get this. Um, so hopefully we get some more information this week or on the newswire on next Tuesday of what exactly is coming in this update because they do state it's a major update. So to me, a major update would be either be some, some major increases to the current roles that we have, maybe some more unlockable tiers, uh, some more avenues or paths to take with the current roles we have, or one or two more roles drops. I don't think it'd be any more than that. You never know, we could get three more roles. I don't think we'll ever get more than three roles at any update. Uh, so one or two more roles may be the, the avenue that we go. We could see no new roles though. I know they want to expand the roles that we have right now. So we may see expandable ranks in those. We may see another 10, 10 unlockable ranks with some more stuff. Now that the bandoliers definitely are 100% guaranteed to be in the game. Are they just going to be purchasable or are they going to be part of the bounty hunter role where you got to use your tokens? So if you didn't save in those tokens, you definitely should have. I got a whole bunch saved in my uh, token bank right now. So the bandoliers may be part of the bounty hunter role that you have to unlock and then purchase or they could just be in the wardrobe. Another awesome thing that we hope to see along with the bandoliers is maybe some of the satchels that the collector outfits have. I, I love some of those cool... Uh, cross-section satchels that uh, the collector outfits have so maybe they'll unlock some of those as well and we can purchase those individually and put on some of our outfits that would be super awesome let me know down in the comments if you guys would definitely buy some of those and throw them on some of your your awesome outfits that everyone's been seeing out there so that's it man we got some pretty awesome news update coming in the month of December that means we probably have less than 30 days before the update because I don't think it'll drop uh, the week of Christmas or the last Tuesday would be the 31st. Although we don't never know Rockstar could do anything. So I'm thinking the 10th or the 17th. We'll hopefully get some more info. They're slowly drip feeding us info on this. As you guys are aware and we mentioned it earlier. Last week we got a little bit of info saying there's a new outlaw pass coming. On Tuesday we got some info on the newswire saying stay tuned soon for next info on the big update. And then hidden in this little newswire here we got a date of a month of December for the next big update. So let's stay tuned and hopeful that on Friday maybe we'll get a newswire stating what's coming because with the summer update a month before it, unfortunately, they did give us a big newswire saying, here's what's coming and outline some of the stuff in the rolls. So hopefully we'll get that come Friday. That would be super awesome. If not, Tuesday at the latest, we'll probably get some more drip feed information. Hopefully they give us a little more breakdown of what's coming and then uh, possibly a date. A date would be awesome to get us all jacked up and ready to jump in here and play this game uh, the way we wanted it to for the last few weeks that we've been grinding out the same old stuff over and over again. So again, make sure to smash a like button if you guys are excited for the next big update coming very soon, very, very soon, actually. If you're new around here, make sure you hit that subscribe button for all new information coming up. Outlining any kind of information for the new update, we'll make sure to get a video out for you as soon as possible. Hey, Cowpoke. 
Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to smash the like button. If you're new around here, consider subscribing to the channel for more Reddit Online content, including tips and tricks, news updates, gameplay, just good old fashioned fun. Hope to see you on the prairie sometime. But until then, see you later.